everyone so I watched this video millions of Christians thrown into an entire stadium for an incredible reason this one it has to do with not forgiving okay so millions and millions or tens of millions who knows lots of Christians are thrown into hell because they are not forgiving other people okay so remember if you don't forgive, God doesn't forgive you. You don't forgive others, God doesn't forgive you. Okay? So that's what that is. I just saved you 18 minutes. All right? How much? <laughs> this goes 40 seconds right there. Okay? Now, the story of this is there's a pastor and his son. They're going on a bike ride. Two cars are racing. At first, they're just watching the cars racing. One car gets out of line, runs them over. Okay, um, the pastor goes into hell and he sees mm, a lot of people in hell just walking around. And remember, if you want to go see the whole thing, I recommend it because you, you see a lot more details. I'm just giving you a quick version. And, you know, he sees, yeah, Christians like him in hell. And he's like, why? Uh, why are these people in hell? And, you know, there were a lot of these Christians, they were hypocrites. Okay, they had deep sins, and um, in his case, you know, he, he sees Jesus, and he's like, "Yeah, why?" Well, you know, hold on, let me check out the notes real quick. Uh, in his case, he was going to hell. Some I just write notes real quick, you know, but they're not like good grammar. Or I misspell stuff, or or I miss, I lots of typos. But anyway, he. Well, he's a pastor, so he gives advice to people to forgive, but he doesn't forgive himself. Uh, <laughs> the advice he gives is very superficial. Just is 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 in the surface, but he doesn't really feel or maybe even care about what they're really going through. He doesn't try to have that deep emotional, you know, or yeah, attachment to what they're going through. He's just giving them, eh, yeah, here, do this. It's like it's like a doctor give, giving a prescription, but the doctor really doesn't care. You know what I'm saying? Like, imagine like that. And that's what he was doing as a pastor. And yeah, he, the guy that ran him over, he was like, I could not forgive the guy that ran me over, right? That's what he was thinking before he had it, before he, he goes down to hell. And so, you know, he goes, uh, he learns to really forgive because it comes from the heart. And also, you know, now he's like really trying to understand what the people are going through and feel what they're going through instead of just giving them superficial, superficial advice. And, um, and. Uh, you know, so now he comes back alive. Jesus sends him back. He wakes up in, in his bed at home with his son also alive too, um, lying down next to him or in, in maybe in another bed next to him, I don't know. And later on, months later, the guy who hit him and his son with a car, and he's like all tattooed out or whatever. And he goes to the pastor and says, forgive me, I'm sorry. And yeah, the pastor forgives him. So remember, one of <coughs> I've watched a lot of these NDEs, and as for Christians, why do they go to what is the number one reason they go to hell? From what I've seen so far, the number one reason is Christians are not sincerely forgiving other people. We have to forgive, okay? And forgiveness really comes from a change of heart. Okay, that change of heart is really you're giving your life to Jesus. When we say we are a sinner, we repent of our sins. We said uh, we believe that Jesus died on the cross for our sins, resurrected in three days for our sins. We accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior and into, into our hearts. You know, we're, we get filled with the Holy Spirit. Well, there has to be a change in our heart in our mind our soul you know it has to be and this kind of change is deep it has to be like it's not like it's beyond just yeah we're living for jesus but like apostle paul said jesus we got to give our lives to jesus to the point where jesus is living through us 
And when you give your life to Jesus to the point where Jesus is living through you, yeah, forgiveness, you can forgive sincerely from the heart. Okay? So remember that. Here, what's sending millions of Christians into hell is that we're not forgiving. We got to forgive. We got to forgive everyone, no matter what they did to us, who they are, whatever they did. All right? Okay. Oh, yeah. Number two, that sends a lot of Christians to hell that I've seen from NDEs are repentance. We're not repenting. We're not sincerely repenting. Okay? All right. God bless all of you in Jesus' name. Amen.